I'm not gonna say what happened in his hotel when this nigga called his. Bro, first of all, you're making it seem like some weird ass gay shit went on, like weird shit went on in there, bro. Like, like first you gotta make sure you tone some. If you're gonna, <coughs> if you're gonna try to attempt a roast or whatever, you gotta tone the thing right, homie. Like you made it seem very sus the way you worded that in there, what it seemed to be. There was nothing else that went down other than you see me roll. You seen how even far I was even distant rolling my blunt up, bro. I was nowhere near like buddy buddy holding fucking arms on side like bro what the fuck is this man talking about? Oh you don't ever tell me or remind me what happened in the hotel. Bro, not it was not even that damn serious for you to have that tone, so just calm down. You're you're scaring me right now. This nigga bro, I gotta tell y'all, I tell y'all everything. Go ahead then, fuck it. The funny reacts is the weird flight. This is why I stopped responding to you when you was down here, bro. You are ah. the best thing I have ever met in my fucking life. Okay, how? And I actually was sitting there trying to hang with you and chill with you, bro. Interesting. Bro, now when I was on Instagram Live. Hold on, let me get this ad on. What? Alright, I'm not even gonna lie. Before he even continues, I told you guys before I even fucking link I'm with this nigga. I'm chill, but I'm cringy, but at the same time, like, everything is normal. So what the fuck was this man surprised about? Now your prior fact, this nigga has reacted to multiple 30, 40, 50 plus type of videos. So he should have known how I possibly could have been. So why is that surprising him all of a sudden I'm cringy? What the fuck? That's like, that, that, that. That, that's like me being a fan of Yao Ming, my nigga, and you know he's fucking tall. And then you see him in person and you just be like, oh my gosh, bro, I didn't know you were that tall. Like, my nigga, you don't, what, you, he just like tried to find something to roast. Alright, thanks, listen. So when I was streaming on fucking Instagram Live, after I got done streaming on Instagram Live, this nigga Flight is the weirdest, crazy nigga school shooter I have ever met in my life. What the fuck did you just call me at the end of the sentence, my nigga? Instagram Live. After I got done streaming on Instagram Live, this nigga Flight is the weirdest, crazy nigga school shooter I have ever met in my what? life. What? This nigga Flight React started vlogging without me knowing. So I'm like, okay. What the fuck are you talking about? You're gonna, this is another thing. This is another thing that got me so spooked out about this man. You, you mean to tell me if somebody that I know is a YouTuber, you're not going to expect them, what, to have a fucking camera near them? Like, you're not going to know, nigga? You knew I had a fucking camera near me, my nigga. What the fuck? That's like me linking with motherfucking, like, Megan Mc Meg McQueen or, like, somebody out in L.A., like, wh whoever, bro. And, and and just me being surprised later on, oh, I didn't know McQueen was vlogging right there, so I didn't know he, he got my catchphrase out in public. My nigga, what is you talking about? You see me with my camera when I get out the Uber the whole time. There was a big, long looking fucking hammer sledge looking thing I was holding what the fuck I was it was only me that showed up so what do you mean you didn't know I was you you were you were being vlogged my nigga you think I'm gonna fly to fucking across the west the fucking uh, the country five hours away from where I live and not have my camera on me and not record every single thing I did from a fucking cactus to a basketball game my nigga what you don't make any sense I could. so he started vlogging Nah, little do y'all know, Flight Reacts, this girl right here, follow me and like my pic. She, she, she want, she want me, she want me. You know what I'm saying? I thought it was her sister, but she want me. It's simple. Now listen, this nigga Flight Reacts calls his girlfriend, question her about her following me on Instagram while I was right there. And then he gave me the phone. No, he had her on FaceTime. Then he Bro, first of all, first of all, this nigga is flipping the story 360 degrees and making me look like a fucking weirdo, bro. Let me tell you what happened. Everything that he said was true. Yes, it was true. From the, the whatever liking or whatever the pics, 
to fucking um, the, the recording of the camera. What I was doing was imitate similar to, have you seen like motherfucking like DG's video where like he had like YMB in the mirror and like he linked up with YMB and then he was just like, oh, YMB trying to take Kennedy away from me. I was trying to do some shit like that. And this nigga's making me look like a fucking weirdo, my nigga. What is you fucking talking about, bro? You knew, first of all, I was vlogging. I told you even prior to it, the second time you even met me, the first time, maybe I should have been like, okay, bro, I have a camera out, um, I may have it fucking recording, and maybe I should tell you this, okay? You see my camera the first time, maybe I should have said something, but the second time, I know damn well, when you came down in the hotel lobby, when you went to fucking go turn up before the, the, the fucking slide, you knew damn well I asked you, I was like, bro, you mind if I record, because I know it's like later on in the night, he was like, bro, I don't mind it. You mean to tell me, bro, I think it's the fucking tree you're smoking, my nigga. That Arizona, that cactus shit has got to fucking go, nigga. I could put you down with some South Florida shit. At least you remember what the fuck you said. I promise you, my nigga. You, I, you, bro, you mean to sit up here and tell me somebody will fly across the state and not bring their camera if fucking their channel, 30, 40, 50% of their channel revolves around fucking vlogging their life. You think they're not going to sit up there and try to record everything. Like, why is that weird to him? That 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 is, is this is the thing that's scaring me right now. Why is that weird to him? Nah, I'm like, hey, she wrong with me. I swear to God, that's what I said. What type of nigga call his girlfriend? But all jokes aside, shout out to Soto because he did show some hospitality though. The nigga showed some hospitality, but I just think he has some memory loss. Without a doubt. Respect so. I had tried to give him all the advice I can definitely give him to like improve on YouTube and like or in real life. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully he takes it or whatever and does useful with it. But dude, he there's something about his memory that we don't fucking know about. Just tell him that. There's something about his memory. That's the only thing that I feel like that is flawed about this dude. He his memory right here, his memory is fucking is fucked up. It's fucked up, dude. He is his his that thing that that operates in the brain that that switches off that's the only thing that's flawed about him dude is a chill ass dude like dude is fucking down there, like bro you just don't have a good memory i don't know what's up with that anyway but yeah bro so show that hospitality i definitely res re like heavily respect that shit Spaces. like most deaf no you wasn't my nigga you know but you know Flight reacts is one weird nigga in real life, bro. I couldn't hang with you after that. That's why I couldn't do no more collabs with you. I 22 zipped you, say goodbye. My nigga, your time has came, say goodbye. Nigga, who the fuck do you think you are? Who the fuck do you think you are? I'll fucking buy another ticket and fucking train better, my nigga. Who the fuck do you think you are? This nigga just said, I just 20 zipped you and just... Threw me away like some trash. My nigga, it is no problem to buy another ticket and really fucking embarrass you, my nigga. First of all, this nigga, let me, let me tell you the fucking story to this shit, bro. Like, now this nigga's made me fuck. <coughs> <coughs> this nigga made me fucking mad, bro. Getting off the fucking airplane, bro. I couldn't even enjoy my time in motherfucking Arizona, my nigga. I just checked into my hotel. I just here before bam fucking 30 minutes later i see a fucking viral twitter video of this nigga already making an interrogation or accusations about me saying oh i know flight i heard flight reactions in arizona which you knew i was gonna be in arizona that fucking day because i fucking said it a week ago on fucking twitter and youtube he sits up here and says i just found out flight reactions touched down in arizona i don't know his intentions like my fucking intentions was to come there and knock him upside the head and take all his fucking money and shoes over fucking basketball, okay? Let's mind you that I was the first thing he said out of his fucking mouth, my nigga. That was the first fucking thing he said out of his mouth. And then he goes like, "There's nothing to do in Arizona Wednesday. Let's drop. Let's let's play today." Didn't even let me breathe, my nigga. Damn, bro. The time zone is fucked up, nigga. I had like one or two hours of sleep. Let me breathe, my nigga. Holy shit. Okay, so that shit threw me off fucking plane as soon as I got to Arizona, my nigga. Okay? The rematch should have been the first game I should have played. In all honesty. But damn, dude.
Nigga knew I was going to be there for four days. As soon as I hop off the plane. Oh my gosh, flight just touched down. He hasn't hit me up. I haven't checked into my hotel yet. I don't know his intentions. Nigga took Tony around and said this. The thing that made me so mad about this, bro, is that he said that he made it seem like I, did, I was like secretly vlogging him like a pedophile. My nigga. Where's my camera, bro? Where's my camera, bro? Where's my camera, my nigga? This is the, this is my camera, all right. And you know what I'm saying? Shout out to baby girl because she got me this this new thing, y'all y'all. You know you know what I'm saying? Some 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 light, baby girl got you know. But anyway, I had this camera with me when I was the first game that we played. The first day, this is the camera I used. The other camera I use is in my other bag. You guys probably seen that before. You're gonna sit up here and tell me, my nigga, if you see a light skin fucking nigga skinny by himself walking with only his Gucci bag in his fucking back and this, hey, carrying it. Even this shit was flipped up, my nigga. This shit was flipped up and I was facing it. I was like, oh my god. Like, I was just like, flight to Santa, da da da, I'm about to hit the court. And that's what he said, look at flight reacts. You didn't mean to tell me you didn't know I was recording, my nigga. I had the camera, bro. Come on, man. Come on. Like, do, do you guys really... I'm scratching my head like, huh? And then you have niggas just... They just think they're just nice at basketball, bro. Like, I want to give the man credit, like LSK, for him getting them dope-ass collabs with, like, nice NBA players. Because you can't hate on that. That shit is... That, that's moves, my nigga. But he gets dropped off so much. Not even from him to people like like Cash, bro. Like, have you have y'all really seen Cash play against people that are like established, like versus versus like um Lamelo or like a like an NBA player, bro? They had no real competition. Everybody's talking so much shit, but I bet you as soon as they play so. In the future, they gonna be just, bro. I just that's why I'm just gonna be sitting back. I'm gonna be sitting back, man. But I guess what else is there finishing the video? I don't know if he was finished talking. Well, let's finish this video though. I ain't seen pops in a minute. This nigga beat up flight right here. Nigga, I did not get beat up. Oh, that shit was lagging. I ain't gonna lie, she looking a little different. She looked different in this video. I like her. I don't know why I like other niggas' bitches rather than... Alright, well, I'm hopping off this bitch. Because I already reacted, like I said, to the video. There's no point. <clears throat> I mean, to the... The 1v1 of Baby Girl reacting. I didn't, um... I already had reacted to him. I'm about to upload it. There's no point. Me watching him just say nonsense and shit. Let's look at some fan lines. Alright, we got some people with the fan lines. My volume is low? What the fuck? 